Hello everybody, this is Jiggly Balls 5000 and today I'm going to talk about why does Infinity Warfare suck balls. So this is going to be the third year which we get with the new movement system where everyone is jumping around, flying, everyone is on top of roofs, houses in the sky and to kill someone is almost impossible and we the fans are tired we have been telling them to change back to boost the ground since I think advanced warfare from that game we're like tired no more but then we got black ops 3 and now we have this game and the game let's say if this game came out after black ops 2 we would have enjoyed the game why? Because it would be something new. And as a game, it doesn't suck. It has a lot of faults. It has some good highlights as well. But because it's the third, I think, third or fourth game with the new movement system, nobody wants the game. All my friends are playing COD 4 Remastered. If it wasn't for COD Remastered, no one would be playing the game. A lot of fans are going from Call of Duty to Battlefield 1 just because people want the feel of Call of Duty like it was Back in the day, World at War, COD 4, Modern Warfare 2, Black Ops 1, those were the best Call of Duty games. And as time passes, as years go by, we keep on getting this sh these shit games. And um, I'm gonna. The, the main highlights why this game sucks, like I said, mostly because of the system, the movement system. But even if you look at the game, it's exactly like Black Ops 3. When you go in, you have the same person in front of you, um, and then when you, you you have with the with the stupid need to buy shit just to earn guns, um, you need to buy the the tokens. And so I haven't played the game a lot because I really didn't like it. I like went up to level I think 30 something, um, like in half a day, just so I can say that I played it and I gave it a chance, and I didn't like it. The, the crypto keys or whatever they call the keys, it's another way for them to make money so I don't like what Call of Duty has become it's all about money they don't really care about the fans if they want to make money they should make a good game so they earn profit from actually people buying the game not in-game profit um, and even when you play the game I must admit it has it has the feeling of um, past Call of Duty it's like Call of Duty Ghost as in the feeling of the guns and I must say Call of Duty Ghost the guns I like the guns so the things that they got the movement of the guns back that's nice and um, it has a little bit of mod Modern Warfare 3 feel as well um, but it's a lot like Black Ops 3 with the specialist with the crypto keys even the map setup um, I didn't really like the game it's like they tried to put a lot in one game even the zombies they grabbed something amazing done by Treyarch which was really really nice in Black Ops 3 every zombie fan loved every single map um, on the world at war Black Ops 1, Black Ops 2 and Black Ops 3 amazing maps done by Trey but when you're trying to take something which is that good trying to change it into something so it doesn't look the same and ending up not looking that good I played zombies once or twice and I did not like it um, I got the season pass because I thought that Zombies was going to be good. I knew that the multiplayer wasn't going to be good because I played the beta. And that's the main reason why Infinity Warfare isn't doing as well as they wanted to. Because it's repetitive. It's the same game that we got the year before and the year before that. And people don't want to spend 70 euros or pounds or wherever you are in the world just to play the same game. If I want to play this game I can play Advanced Warfare. If I want to play um, shit zombies I'll go on a bloody PC mod and play zombies made by average people which you don't need to pay for. Because this is what I think about zombies. It's not nice. I will give it another chance when the first season, uh, the first DLC map comes out. I will try the zombies. But um, COD 4 is what people are playing. Um, there is competitive gaming on Infinity Warfare which again I don't like if you don't like the game you like nothing to do with it um, that's why everyone is playing COD 4 and um, the next map the, the, the next game done by I think Sledgehammer 
We've done advanced warfare. We'll probably get another shit game with the same movement that people do not want. So I'm waiting for not next year, it's the year after that, when Treyarch, if they know what they are doing, they should get a game called World of War Two. They com they complete the series. They base it on 1940 Second World War, and that would be an amazing game. Look at Battlefield One. They're making so much money, and people are getting the game. And when you have Call of Duty fans going to Battlefield One, just because they miss Call of Duty back in the old days, that's sad. It's like FIFA players, FIFA players going to PES. You could, we cannot lose all these fans. It's bad for the fans because they're not enjoying the game, and it's bad for Call of Duty franchise because they're losing money and a lot of fans. So they need to work on that. The next game needs to be good. At least we have caught four and at least we're gonna get all the maps in December. So guys if you enjoyed this video and if you agree with me please leave a like below. The next video will be why Infinity Warfare doesn't suck because there are some nice highlights in every game but in general it does suck. So guys, see you guys in the next one.